Welcome back to Cooking with Tootie. I hope you enjoyed my first video. I have a lot more to come. So today I'm gonna to do my special dish. It is called my taco dip. So I'm gonna go step by step and let you know, let you see how I make it. So here we go, let's get started. The first thing that we have to do is I have to open up my sour cream. I'm gonna pour it in the bowl. So I'm gonna pour some sour cream in the bowl. And I'm going to get some more in there. Yep. Okay. And I'm gonna get some more. Okay. I'm gonna stop right there for a minute. And what I'm gonna do is open up my ranch dip. You're gonna mix this with the um, sour cream. Okay. So I'm gonna mix this in. Just a little. And we're gonna mix this together. We're gonna mix this together. It smells so good. When you try this, you will love it. Um, it's something real easy to make. Okay. And I'm going to put it in my bowl. So we're going to do the first layer. Okay. And we're just going to put it in the bowl. gonna mix some more. I'm just gonna spread it out. And we're gonna we're gonna pour some more in here and mix some more. Now we have I already had did the um ground turkey already and already drained it already. So what I'm gonna do is put some ground turkey on the first layer. Make sure you spread it all the way, all the way, around, all the way through, on top. It smells so good, y'all. Yes, it does. And it looks good too already. I'm not even through with it. Okay. And I usually make this dish mostly in the summertime. Uh, for family gatherings. Yeah. It's a good dish. And it's, it's not that heavy. Not too, too heavy. What I'm going to do is take my tomatoes. And I'm just going to spread it on the top. So your next step you want it to be the lettuce <clears throat> so I already washed and cleaned the lettuce so what I'm gonna do is just spread just a little on here you have to try this guys this, I mean it's, it's amazing when you um when you put it together it tastes good real good and they ranch make it taste so good okay so and then what you're going to do is just put a little cheese on this layer it's a quick dish it don't take long to make it but you're going to put some more on the next layer so you don't want to overdo it okay so I'm gonna let you see the first layer of it. So we're gonna do the um the next next one now. Okay. Okay. All right. So what we're gonna open up the second thing of sour cream. Okay. And we're gonna 
open this up. Okay. And you're gonna do the same thing. Just put this in the um in the bowl so we can stir it up with some more ranch dressing. So I'm gonna put this in here. So what we're gonna do is take the dip. Move that to the side. We're gonna take the dip, ranch dip, and we're gonna pour it in here. stir this up some more yes you want to make sure you stir it up real good the ranch dressing the not ranch dip smells so good okay and you also can use ranch dressing I'm usually I used to use ranch dressing but I was also, I also noticed that the ranch dip is better to use instead of the ranch dressing. So what you're gonna do is do another layer. for my family when we go have a family gathering they love it yes they do they love it and I haven't made it in a while so I figured this would be a good dish for me to let my um <sighs> do on my channel so just to show you guys you know something new that you can make Okay, so I did cover it up on there, the rest of the ground turkey. And what you're doing is just spreading it, spreading the turkey on top. That's all you're doing. Spreading the turkey on top. Yep. Okay, so, just a little bit more, guys. Okay, and we just gonna cut up some more tomatoes just so we can make sure that we have enough okay. so now my next step is we're going to put the tomatoes spread on there Once you finish this dip, it goes straight in the refrigerator. You know, once you get through eating it, eating whatever you're going to eat off of it, put it in the refrigerator, it's good to go for another round. So, okay. So now I'm going to take the cheese and I'm going to put the cheese all around it. Then we 
we're gonna do is I'm gonna open up the other cheese just to spread a little bit more on top. You wanna make sure you have enough cheese on top of this. do is just to put it on top what I'm going to do is put a few black olives not that many just enough just to put on top finish touches okay and plus I'm also going to there you go that's the finished touch of it and I'm also going to show you a plate at the end um, that's all to it that's all you have to do and this is called my excuse me it's called my taco special dip so use to eat with it with your own taco dip. So I hope everybody have a good night and finish enjoying. I'm having another video tomorrow, so tune in.